Hi, this is Jim Wright. And in this lesson, we'll create a lathe post processor. Our lesson plan is to create a two axis lathe post processor. We will then test the initial output. And then finally, we will switch the rough turn OD operation for cycle 95 output, and we will test that also. Before we begin, I'd like to remind you that it's very important that you have an NC test part that tests all the capabilities of the NC machine tool. Ideally, this part would come from the customer's database. It also should have all the functionality required by the NC machine. In this scenario, we'll create a new post processor using the Siemens 840D output. We'll examine that initial output and then we'll switch cycle 95 on and test that output also. Let's get started. In Post Builder, I will create a new lathe post using File, New. First, give the post a name. Change the post output unit to metric. It is a lathe post, two axis. Use the Siemens 840D lathe control as my template. The reason I want to use the Siemens control is I would like to demonstrate cycle 95 for rough turn output. Choose OK. Many of the parameters for a lathe post are the same as those we saw for a mill. One difference is diameter versus radius programming. For a lathe, we have the option to turn on diameter, or if we turn it off, it's radius programming. We can also mirror the output in X and Z. Under Program and Toolpath, there are fewer options than on a mill post because a lathe has fewer slides. I like to test my post as quickly as I can, so I'll save this post. As two axis lathe. Then I will test it in Cam Express. I have a lathe file that tests all of the functions that I wish to test for this post. I have rough turning OD, spot drill, drill, rough bore, finish bore, finish turn, groove OD, and thread OD. To test the post, I highlight the program, choose post process, and browse for my new post. Choose OK. And I have posted output for the entire program. Notice that at the beginning for the rough turn OD operation, we're outputting X and Z as necessary to rough the OD of the part. Some shops like to use built-in cycles for their machine tools. Lathes with Siemens controls have cycle 95 for rough turn OD. Post Builder supports cycle 95 for Siemens controls, beginning with version 8 of Cam Express or NX Cam. I'll demonstrate. Highlight the rough turn OD operation. Under Machine Control, set the motion output to Machine Cycle. I can then name the subroutine whatever I wish it to be called. OD 
rough. Generate the operation. Now when I post-process this operation, you can see that the post is supporting cycle 95. We have the cycle 95 statement and the beginning marker and the end marker of the finished profile of the part, followed by the parameters for step overs and cut depth. Later on in the program, we define the actual profile. In summary, you learned how to create a two-axis lathe post-processor, you tested the initial output, and then you turned on cycle 95 and saw its output also. Thanks for viewing. Our next lesson will be about how to create a simple mill turn post processor.